G'day there. Uh, welcome to an Actor Talks for another week. Uh, it's a very warm day in Sydney. I don't know what temperature we got, but it was very warm, very sticky. Hopefully it's going to uh, rain and it's going to be wind up. Um, uh, some exciting news with uh, actors talk about themselves. Uh, you may see a familiar face in there. Um, I'm going to be talking to a friend of mine, Dino Gorman, uh, in a week's time. So that's going to be very exciting. Um, I'm just editing that now as we speak, so that's something to look out for. Uh, it was great to catch up with him. Um, now, th this week I'm going to talk about something that I think is really important, not just for acting, but for life. Uh, it's called persistence. Um, and <laughs> I've, been, I've had one of those weeks or two weeks where, you know, I've been busy, I've been doing lots of auditions, some things have landed, some things haven't, and it's, I don't know, it sort of happens, I guess, in, in this industry in particular, where, you know, you really have to just keep generating yourself, and you just have to keep going, basically, you know, in the face of, you know, there's always rejections, you don't get every audition, um, you know, you might not even get auditions, um, you know, you might not you know get a lot of other work uh, you have to try and find other ways to sustain yourself financially that's all part of being an actor um and you know like the the world environment at the moment is is pretty tight so you know i guess that's what i've been going th through lately and uh you know what i've really found is that it's so easy just to go and i can see a lot of people do it especially if you want to be an actor or be in this industry to go look it's just all too hard i'm going to go and find something easy and you know i've got to tell you that there's been many times in my life recently where i've gone maybe i should just get a normal job maybe i should just do something that's you know easier where i can get a regular income i know where my money's coming from you know um but i guess what keeps drawing me back to it is is just this is my passion this is what i really love to do um i mean even doing this video blog part of me was like oh i can't be bothered or it's all too hard you know this is something i decided to do and to share what i'm doing with you guys on a regular basis and this is something i've committed myself to and it's great even for me to talk about this kind of stuff is a really good thing for me you know to talk about you know to, to work through you know what i go through uh, daily as an actor so you know persistence i've probably said it before but i'm going to say it again it's such a massive thing in this industry you know you make the choice and whether it's whether you're an actor or doing any other type of job you know what i've found you just have to regardless of what some people tell you regardless of even some of the results you get you just have to keep picking yourself up every single day and going this is how it's going to be this is what i'm going to do and if it's something you really love doing and i really love this industry i love creating stuff you know i've uh, i've said i've done all these sketches <laughs> and i haven't produced any yet so um I went to film one today and uh, something sort of got on the road, but uh, I'm going to start producing those over the next week or two. Um, I've got one in particular, a character called Angry Gary, um, who you might have seen on one of my other videos. He did a, um, a blooper audition. Um, so I'm going to explore that. I'm also going to look into the areas of, uh, of language uh, when it comes to you know the different phrases from Australia and New Zealand, because I'm a New Zealander and I live in Australia, so I'm looking to explore that. Anyway, that's going to be in a couple of weeks. Um, but yeah, that's that's the sort of thing. It's just so easy just to sit sit back. And, and the other thing you'll find in this industry is that you tend to have a lot of time. You have to generate things. You have to generate work for yourself. Um, you know, so it's, it's just a constant. You've just got to pick yourself up and keep going in the face of, you know, you get good successes and then you might have some quiet patches. So... You know, I guess that's a lesson. If you're uh, if you're looking to, to get into acting, or you're acting at the moment, uh, or you you know want to get into this industry, it's just it's like persistence. If it's something you really want to do, just keep at it. Just keep going. Don't listen to anyone else. Just keep going. If you really believe, and the other thing I believe too is if you visualize stuff, and if you say no, that's what I'm going to do, and that's what I'm going to be doing, and you truly believe it, then you know you'll get those sort of results. And, you know, I think that's something you should take into every part of your life, whatever job you're doing, you know, just have that belief in yourself um, because it's very easy to bow to self-doubt. It's very easy to listen to all the voices in your head saying you're not good enough and the voices saying that you can't do it and you're never supposed to do that. And, and the other thing I quite often find is that they usually come about at a time when you're about to have some success, you know. If you go through most of your life, with, which I probably did, thinking I wasn't good enough to do certain things, as soon as you 
find yourself in a position where you are good enough and you're achieving stuff, the first thing that cuts in is that little voice that tells you you're not. So don't listen to that. Um, that's my word of advice and my blog for this week. It's good to get it out. It's been an interesting week, um, but it's been a typical week as an actor, as a performer, um, as an artist, as a creative person. So, you know, it's onwards and upwards. I've got plenty done. Um, you know, my life's great. <laughs> it's all good. Um, so, yeah, Dean, next week. Can't wait. I'll put the trailer out about Tuesday and Wednesday um, and look out for that interview next week and uh, a few other things sort of coming up to Christmas time. Have a nice one. Cheers. Yeah, nah, sweet.